Daniel Bryan comes out to cut a promo, AJ Styles interrupts him because he what even is a brand split anymore. Bailey and Bianca have a match that should mean something, but ultimately means nothing. Cesaro takes a look at the next big thing he has to swing. Dominic Mysterio pulls out the classic babyface move of attacking the heel Baron Corbin from behind before the match begins. Because hey, it worked for the Avengers when they attacked Thanos, because why wouldn't it work for him? Biggie, Sonya Deville, John Morrison, and the Miz have a backstage segment because you know what even is a brand split anymore. Natalia faces to me to see who gets the number 30 inch of the Royal Rumble because, you know, ah, can't import that. It's only the most important number to get in the match, so what better way to emphasize that by having two people who have done nothing on the shows compete for it? I'm just saying you had Bailey versus Bianca on the same show. You couldn't have just given the stipulation to that. Sasha has a segment with a guy she beat up last week. What's a bad bunny? Sami Zayn and Shinsuke Nakamura more reminiscent about their history together. I'd say you can cut the tension with a knife, but hey, they don't own those backstage. But hey, if you ask the Undertaker, he'd love to have those back, so men can be men! Kevin Owens and Roman Reigns have a backstage segment. Daniel Ryan versus AJ Styles is about to start, and it looks like it's going to be given a lot of time. But actually, no, it just turns into a multi-man tag match because, you know, hey, what even is a brown split at this point? 